And now, your first alert five weather. Hey everybody, check out what some of the worst wind chills were this morning, and these were registered pretty close to 6 a.m. So if you look at these values, Monument, Black Forest, Falcon, a lot of northern El Paso County and up into the foothills saw some of the coldest temperatures, but that Monument wind chill was negative 33, and I saw Centennial was pretty close to it as well. Pueblo, the winds were much more calm overnight, so the chill got to negative 16, Definitely not as aggressive as what we were to the north. Now our big story through today was that climb above zero and we were able to do that today. Even actually by mid morning temperatures were above zero and I plotted the next 36 hours. It's kind of neat to see how from noon today all the way even into Saturday at midnight. So as Christmas Eve turns to Christmas, Temperatures really only get better from here. Even the overnight lows have the potential to be a little warmer than where we are here at noon. And when we look at your Colorado Springs temperature going into the afternoon, we're going to be in those mid 40s. So Saturday actually looks pretty nice. Now in Pueblo, it's a little bit different with the clear skies and lower elevation. Pueblo goes from 9 at 4 o'clock back to a low around negative four. And so we still have negatives into the start of Saturday. That being said, look at the changeover into Saturday afternoon, a pretty good warm up to about 42 degrees. So your high temperatures today, the warmest air will be west. Now that's pretty cool for a couple reasons. One, helping any sort of mountain roads out for travel west. Two, this is a huge weekend for skiing. And so looking towards Monarch Mountain, it won't be too bad in our neck of the woods. We've got single digits from Pueblo to La Junta, Crowley Cali County, almost so quite cold. And then tonight, it is still getting below zero in a lot of portions of the plains from Pueblo County out along Highway 50, La Junta, Lamar, Crowley County, Kiowa County. We're still recommending keeping your cabinet doors open so that air can circulate near those pipes on exterior walls and you're going to be less likely to get freezing or any sort of water breaking problems. Like we said, couple big stories going forward are the warm up to Christmas Day. We're actually on Sunday like 10 degrees warmer than the average high in Pueblo. I think that we're 55 on Sunday and then mid 60s into next week. So some pretty cool stuff coming our way without much snow this weekend. Three day outlook shows a little bit up north and some modeling is going with about one to two inches in steamboat and maybe through Saturday about an inch or so towards Vail. So very little additional ski resort snow. Christmas Day looking at a high of 54 degrees, which is 10 degrees above normal. But Sunday night or Saturday night through Sunday morning, that clear skies through Santa, widespread highs in the 50s, and there should be no travel problems statewide with a high of 60 on Tuesday. Pueblo, mid 50s on Sunday, although the mornings are pretty cold through the next few days, and 65 on Tuesday. Pretty incredible stuff there. Canyon City. We're close to 60 on Sunday and Monday, and then we have a small chance of rain to snow on Thursday with Woodland Park. Lots of 40s out through time, dry skies, and yes, a little bit of snow by Thursday.